picked today are actually these earrings which I'm wearing right now. The inspiration behind them was my favorite season and time of the year in Bombay which is the monsoon. From that thought, the conceptualization to the sketch to actually um, producing the piece, um, it, was, it was all very special to me. The piece I picked for today is a piece that's very close to my heart and is called the water lilies. When I came across these two wonderful pair of over 10 karat plus modified emerald cut diamonds, it completely took me back to one of my travels to the Palace of Versailles. There was a pond called the Water Lily Pond. This has not only inspired me, but inspired many a master craftsman, even artists like Monet. So for this story, we selected the shoulder sweepers we were contacted with our uh, our PR agency in America and they were looking for something very exciting for Katy Perry. And it had to be something fabulous, showstopper, at the same time reflect her personality, which is larger than life. So when we were designing this beautiful piece of jewelry and the collection, what we did, we used brilliant cut diamonds and we accentuated them with rose cut diamonds. While one adds a subtlety, the other adds the dazzle. The piece I've picked out for the story today are these white diamond dangling earrings. We call them the shell danglers. They're set in white gold with white diamonds and oval rose cuts. So I was in Maldives walking on the beach and I have a habit of just collecting nice, you know, different kind of shells. I just wanted to pick up the pattern of the shell and then add the little delicacy that I see in like the water and the tides. And that's why I gave them these tiny rose cut droplets. From the time I conceptualized it to the sketch to actually going into crafting it, I was involved the whole time with every piece we picked, you know, with the shading of the pink and I like the movement of it, I like the colors of it. I was really happy with the way it turned out, uh, so much so that I kept a piece for myself. This earring is very important to me because the, of the rarity of the gems and the perfect matching of the two modified emerald cuts and it just turned out so beautiful. So when we got the final product in our hands, we were ecstatic. The nine lines flowing fluidly like a waterfall from a very thin crescent. Therefore, we thought, you know, the first iteration of the design we should keep it in the family and send the second one to Katy Perry. We made one motive and then we layered them. It just turned out brilliant. I never expected it to look as stunning as it did. And that's why I held on to it.